楚，你真是他们的。Does your dog snore audible enough to disturb you? And because you can't sleep, it seems louder than what it really is. Perhaps you should you should consider not immediately becoming angry or externalizing that anger. Shut up! <laughs> because the dog will just fall back asleep, and your anger will only build. You won't be able to take it much longer if you don't do something about、Lock、it. Up! But please do not abuse the actual dog. <laughs>、uh! Ah! 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 Perhaps you should consider making love to the dog. <laughs> But if he doesn't like it, <clears throat> oh no 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 no! Don't do that! Oh! <laughs> But if he does, then you're really in trouble. Good, because he won't leave you alone. Good girl. What makes you think it's a girl? Will you marry me? I do. You're gonna lie to me. Oh wait, I threw it away. No,、oh, I didn't. Yes, I, I have a lighter. You have a lighter. I have a lighter. He has a lighter. Recently, over Iowa, there have been many UFO sightings, and it's not that they are actual aliens; it's that people are completely illiterate and partly retarded because chemical factories are in the vicinity. So when there is a report that there is an unidentified flying object, otherwise known as the acronym UFO, the police do not take it seriously. But one tragic day, there were, in fact, aliens. All these aliens know of our world are the people they see in this small town. Rednecks. Biatches, welfare check recipients. The aliens understand fully by the time they leave what it means to get government support, and this is the fall of an ancient civilization of extraterrestrial beings. Because these great scientists, travelers of space. Began instituting programs in which they did not need to labor. They discovered the entertainment industry, the simulated life, video games, pills that make one orgasm upon taking, pills that make one orgasm upon thinking, and orgasms that make people take more pills. And so you see, we cannot allow. No. These aliens to corrupt us further、no. than we have corrupted them. No. So, me, as your next president, would like to propose the annihilation of any species of intelligent life. I'm proposing genocide of any alien species, so we may be kept safe from the welfare state. Mr. President, brought to you by the Republican Party. Fuck you!、Uh, it's like once get light pipe. Now it's time for Chef Gourmet. We take a trip down memory lane to Chef Gourmet. Lovely kitchen and the beautiful posh gardens in Las Vegas, Mister Culinary Man. As you can see, the oil that I use doesn't begin bubbling until the temperature gets quite hot. What kind of oil do you use?、Uh, this is actually a mixture. I will say two ingredients. The third ingredient I'll leave out for posterity. The first ingredient. Can you guess? Can you smell it? It's the dominant odor. Olive oil. 
No, you don't want actually want to uh, fry with olive oil. That's dangerous. Why? It's a good tip. Oh no, it just breaks down, and it's not—it's dangerous to fry with olive oil. I do it all the time. You don't know what you're talking about. It's good shit. It, it does taste good. It does. But it's very unhealthy. Who cares? Well, it looks like we're out of time. Thanks for joining us with the culinary motherfuckers. And I'm a <laughs> motherfucker, and so are you. <laughs> Pole dancing 101. Who? Pole dancing 101. Jimmy, take over. <laughs> excellent. Pole dancing 102. Jimmy, take over. <sighs> oh, excellent. Uh, Jimmy 101. Mm, take over. Mm. Uh, yeah. As you notice, Jimmy 101 and pole dancing 102 mm. are nearly identical. Mm. This is because the Jimmy mm. is an instrument that was designed mm. around the cultivated experience mm. of pole dancing in which mm. all coercive mm. maneuvers are kept obstruct mm. and abstract. Mm. So please, oh. if you do indulge in any sort of postmodern artistic endeavors, to My. use copious amounts of intelligible words so people ah. think at least that you are doing something remotely coherent, My and they can back. laugh and agree and say, My back. My back. <laughs> My back hurts. My back hurts. I pulled a muscle. I pulled a muscle. I pulled them all, I, I think. I pulled them all, I think. I pulled them all. 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 One by one. One by one. 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 <sighs> Smoking smoke. What the smoke brother is. I'm smoking smoke. What's you smoking? I'm smoking the smoke. You smoking the smoke? Yeah, this is a good smoke. We smoking the smoke, ladies and gentlemen. We smoking the smoke, ladies and gentlemen, and we, we would like to present to you some smoke for you. Mm-hmm. For only nineteen ninety five a quarter. Yeah, mm-hmm. that's nineteen ninety five a quarter. Nineteen ninety five a quarter. That's plus tax, of course. Now that marijuana is illegal. Mm-hmm. But for nineteen ninety five and a quarter, mm-hmm. four quarter, mm-hmm. any quarter, mm-hmm. no quarter though, because quality will not stand in the way. Quantity over quality. Yes, quantity over quality. Who wants really good Mary, but only one little leaf? Yeah. One little leaf <laughs> won't get you very far with the Mary, but if you smoke 27 joints and 38 blunts, the quality <laughs> doesn't matter. Not the quantity a... matters more. Mo. That's why we can give it to you at a very special price. 1995 and a quarter. Woo! Faith Mountain. <laughs> <laughs> Coming down the aisle! <laughs> <laughs> They're getting married. Do a pro wrestling marriage. Welcome to the Omni in Atlanta, Georgia. It's time for yet another extravaganza. We're going to have something absolutely phenomenal. It is time now for. Coming down the aisle, being wed to his bitch of a valley, Rick Blair! <laughs> Ricky, I told you to stop smoking that fucking joint. We gotta get married, Ricky. Come on. <laughs> I don't care. Ricky, come on. You're in front of a live studio audience. Behave. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a totally fabulous. We're going to send Ric Flair, finally. Finally. Finally, because he couldn't wrestle anymore. Anyway, Ric Flair, you're going to be married to this lovely valet that you call your wife. Is that right? Woo! That is, I guess, yes. All right, and you, what's your name? Um, Rhonda. Okay, Rhonda. Rhonda and Rick. Rick and Rhonda. Hey, Rhonda. Yes? Did you ever get body slammed by Ric Flair? Uh, not anymore, because he can't get, can get up, if you know what I mean. You mean he taps out? Yeah. So you pin him? You're actually dominant? Yes. Wow. Rick, what do you have to say to that? Woo! You gonna step in the square ring? Woo! Rhonda? Yeah? Get your ass in the ring! Okay. It is set for a one minute bout because that will all it take to Rick Flair to be beaten. Ding, there's the bell. Rhonda, that's me. Rick? Woo-hoo-hoo. On the floor now. Good boy. I'm gonna pin you. One, two, three. Ding, ding, ding. 
This what? Is now, 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 wait a minute. Hold on a second now. What? When did they start using a three count in pro wrestling? <laughs> I thought it was a like a three count and then and then fake getting up and then fall back down and then count some more and then make it to ten, right? Isn't it a ten count? No, that's boxing. That's boxing? Yes. What's the difference? They're different? Yeah. Numbers. Numbers? Yes. Wrestling one, two, three. Oh, it's boxing. all mathematical. Yeah. So do you have to have a degree to become a pro wrestler? Some do, yeah. Some degree? Some de- <laughs> to some degree, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go back to the ringside with Rhonda and Rick. Woo! Hi, um Do you, Rhonda? Yes. Take this man? Yes. To be your lawfully wedded husband. No. Ooh. No? My goodness gracious, here in the Omni Atlanta or whatever we are, I'm surprised you're being denied, Ricky Flair. <laughs> you're just joking, right, Rhonda? Yeah. Oh, you have a sense of humor. Yeah. And you're also blonde. Yeah. And you're a dumb blonde. Yeah. That's, that's I think Ric Flair's getting mad. Is he? Ric Flair, are you getting a little angry there? Woo! Get a little wet on the collar. All right, look, this is this uh, terrible uh, matrimonial yeah. uh, excuse for a wedding over. You do, you do. Yeah. Do you do, Rick? Woo! You do, Rick? I said woo. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> In case you didn't know, that was the end. <laughs> da 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 da. Here at Mutation, we like to constantly expand orifices. Yeah. Mutation Comedy proudly presents Mutation Comedy. Don't blow yourself, cause we won't do it for you. Mutation Comedy! <laughs> <laughs>